again. So the question now became whether someone could be renominated. If it's, if it's open for nomination, someone could be renominated. You could nominate me. If it's open for renomination, I'm not suggesting. Are you volunteering? It's something you want to do, but, but okay. if it's open, it's open. All right. Oh boy. So the, do you have another question for Mr. Kucha? Nope, thank you. I'm going to bring it real close so that he can hear. Please. Okay, thank you. Thank you. So the question is renominations or nominations. Mr. Frasca. I'd like to make a nomination. Yes. I'd like to nominate Dr. James Carter. Okay. Ms. Coleman. I would like to renominate Timothy Luff as he aligns closest to. Am I allowed to say anything? Excuse me? Wait a minute. You have the floor. Okay. Um, I would like to renominate Timothy Luff as I believe he closely aligns with what we are looking for as a district. Okay. Any other nominations? Ms. Donnelly. I'd like to renominate Dr. Carter also. Any other nominations? Mrs. Al Jamal. I'd like to renominate Mr. Timothy Luff. Okay. So we have two nominations for Mr. Carter, Dr. Carter, and two nominations for Mr. Luff. I'll make a motion to nominate Ms. Dr. Carter. Anyone else? Mr. Torello? I'll nominate John Graceffo. Oh, I am not originally from Waltham. I do not know Mr. Graceffa. I He didn't interview for the position. As far as I know, he didn't submit an application for the position. How am I supposed to, from either a personal experience or a professional experience, I have no knowledge of him. How am I supposed to gauge that? Okay. Similar to the last meeting, and that's a fair question. Mm -hmm. Similar to the last meeting, normally when someone nominates someone, they give something of what, why they're doing it. Okay, so I will, through the chair, ask the maker of the motion to answer your question. All right, through the chair to Mr. Chirallo, um, could you please explain to me your reasoning for nominating Mr. Graceffa, your experience working professionally with Mr. Graceffa, as well as why you would nominate this candidate when he did not submit an application for this position? Yep. Um, so Mr. Kristoffer used to be a school committee member here for, for several years. He was also the former high school principal for many, many, many years. Um, I feel he knows Waltham, he knows where we've been, he knows where we're going. Um, and I feel that he could do the job that we need to have done. He's been working at Arlington Catholic um, in charge of their entire school, I guess, network I don't even know how to classify it but it's from infants all up to, to 12th grade any other questions Ms. Coleman through the chair to Mr. Torello as he's 
been working with another district is how, how do you even know that he would be interested in this position when we've had to evaluate the other candidates they had to submit on their own their qualifications um, their notice periods um, how, how am I and I don't mean this with any disrespect I just genuinely don't know um, is there an interest level there um, what would be a notice period is he willing to look at two years you know I mean he's gainfully employed right now as you said so like why would he want to leave that to come here when he didn't submit an application um, I think the opportunity to come back and, and work for Waltham and help us through this difficult period of time would be something that he would jump at the opportunity for. Thank you. Ms. Donnelly? <clears throat> Ms. Donnelly? Yeah, may I ask you what is this difficult period of time? Um, the transition to a new high school the location of our the language school, um, the reuse of this building, the potential of the number of retirements in central office and the retirements of principals that are on the horizon. He has the knowledge of the district over, I'm gonna say decades um, to be able to shepherd us through this this period to where we can have a proper search for a, a long-term superintendent. He's not looking to increase his resume in any way. He's not using this as a stepping stone. I think it, he'd make a good shepherd for, for a period of time. Any other questions? Okay. 